So that is it for the box. Now let's go to the postcard. Hello my Hello Kitty fans, this is Hello Gabius and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, welcome to my channel. Don't forget to subscribe, hit that bell notification and like this video. In today's video, I want to show you the latest Pusheen box. The Pusheen box has been an amazing box. I do want to let you know that I have renewed my subscription with Pusheen box for another year. So this will be my second, going on my second year with Pusheen box. I absolutely love the Pusheen box and as you have seen on previous videos the Pusheen box just do not disappoint they're just so amazing everything that they have in the box is just so well worth it great quality products and I hope that you agree if you have any other thoughts regarding the Pusheen box please comment down below and let me know how you feel about the Pusheen box and if you would be interested in subscribing to the Pusheen box I am not an affiliate of Pusheen box for of culture fly just so you know but nevertheless let me show you the latest pushing box this is the summer 2022 pushing box again I love it that when they ship these boxes it comes in a plastic wrap because I love to keep these boxes and I love when they use the plastic wrap which they always do because the box is going to be clean no scratches or dirt and things like that things that are important to me um, also the boxes never come crushed which is amazing so this box like every other box is a little hefty but they're all hefty that's kind of no surprise anymore but let's open it up and see what we got for the summer 2022 pushing box So just to show you the box quickly, I removed the plastic wrap and now I can see the box a little bit better. So you do see that it was bent a little bit here and then of course on the corners here. So um, I mean it's a part of the shipping process I guess. I don't really like that on my boxes to be honest with you. Uh, but nevertheless, I got my box. So this so. is what we have for the box and just like any other box, I do not like to look at previous posts from other YouTubers and Instagram because I want to be absolutely surprised when I open up my box and I am completely surprised as all the boxes. So uh, here is the card and it says feeling like a snack. So that is the card for this box and then of course on the back it does tell me what I should get in the box and I will come back to this card later <sighs> so this is a Mio Charo vinyl toy so it looks like coffee it's like a coffee theme I'm assuming so I wonder if there's three which one I will get so So look at, so here's Pusheen and she is on an actual glass cup, it's plastic and the saucer. So this is so cute, I mean for those that have like a little coffee theme in their uh, kitchen, this would be a great decoration for it for sure. So this is the vinyl toy and it is so, so cute. Cool, so first item, a vinyl toy. Second item is a little plushie, and this is what I'm looking at. And this is a Pusheen, and it looks like she could be maybe like on top of a, like a big old marshmallow is what it looks like to me. So this might be or like in a cup and this is like the straw or the little uh, like a wafer straw that you normally have for your coffees or hot chocolates. And so this is the tag and I really like the tag because when you move it she is moving her little tail. She's wagging her tail when you move the label. That's pretty awesome. Cool. 
Oh, so this is a great, cute little plushie. Ooh, now with the clothing. So, of course, we have a shirt. And it goes with the theme brown in like a cafe color. And this is the shirt. And the shirt says cappuccino. So it says cappuccino. It has a, a weird smell, uh, but I wash all of my shirts before use anyway. So let me just show you the label. So I do subscribe to the small box. And this is the shirt from the previous box. And like, again, this is a small and it's pretty uh, roomy still. So I think small is like perfect for me. It's it could almost be like a, a medium size in, in actual sizes, uh, but I think a small is, is good enough, not an extra small. So, and I love that the sleeves are dark brown and there's nothing in the back, nothing in the back. And then this is the tag. Cool, so we have an awesome shirt. Ooh, what is this? Feeling like a snack. So I'm assuming this is like a little bento box. So let's check it out. It has a flexible lid, but I'm also noticing, so it has closure on all four sizes, and I'm noticing that this lid, you can uh, open it or undo it like and when you're gonna put it in the microwave you can let the steam vent air out there and then the little tray it's like a little flexible collax collapsible little tray really soft silicone really cute I really like this one so then this is your little uh, little warming tray or little snack tray So there you go. Really cool. I love it. Just to show you again the label. This is the label for it. So we have a collapsible snack box. Ooh, what is this? This is a reusable ice pack. That is interesting. I wonder why you need an ice pack for like a coffee themed box. So let's check it out. And so this is the ice pack. And it's Pushim and she's like a cream puff. The label for it and here is the label on the packaging. Cool, so an ice pack, that's interesting. Oh, so we have it looks like a, a lunch bag. So that makes sense why they would include um, a little ice pack. So let's see. Ooh, so it looks like it's a tote for sure. Um, this is a picnic tote. Let me show you the label for it. Picnic tote. And the color of the picnic tote has like croissants and all these cream puffs and other kinds of desserts and it is a lunch bag material so definitely if you're going to go on a picnic you can uh, definitely take this with you and if things get wet in there it's okay because it's that kind of material that you can easily rinse off so cool we have a picnic tote Oh, we have another, looks like another bag maybe. It looks like a roll here. What is this? So this is a picnic blanket. Wow. See there? Picnic blanket. Ooh, this is interesting. So let me see if I can open this. Or how do you open it? Let's see. Okay, so 
And again, it's the same material as the toe, like a lunch bag uh, material. That's what the material is for this blanket. And, um, whoa. Ooh, you do have cushion here, just like the plushie. Sure, you can see that. That's what that is, and it's like just like a uh, like a checkered pattern, dark brown, yellows, and creams, and it's a pretty long blanket. That's for sure. Cool. And I'm trying to see the tag within the blanket. Let me just show you the tag that has that the blanket has. And that's it, just like washing instructions. You do not wash it, it's just hand wash. It's really just a rinse off. Because if anything gets wet here, even mud, you can just rinse it off. Um, but this is a pretty awesome idea, actually. Really cool item for a picnic. So we have a blanket. Oh, and then lastly, it looks like it's a uh, bottle opener. Let me just show you here. So this is so sh this is like uh, she's a croissant here, and it's a bottle opener. And then this is the bag and. So cool. Now let's go to the postcard to make sure that I got everything that I was supposed to get. So we should have gotten eight items and according to the postcard, uh, we should have gotten the vinyl toy and we did, really cute. Uh, we should have gotten the tote, we got the picnic tote. We should have gotten the blanket, we definitely got the blanket. We should have gotten the little uh, collapsible warming little storage tray, we did. We got the shirt, definitely. We got the ice pack, definitely got the ice pack. We got the bottle opener, and then lastly is the plushie. So we got all of the items, and there are eight items. Now, all of the items, as all of the pushing boxes, are so well worth it. So my favorite items has to be the shirt and this little snack box. I absolutely love that they also include it to where you can open up the hole so it can vent while you're warming it up in the microwave. I think that's very awesome, very updated for what you need nowadays. Um, as far as my thoughts for this box, now I do have to say that I, it seems like it's a coffee theme, which is great, um, but I do not understand the picnic uh, for a coffee theme because um, I normally wouldn't think of bringing coffee with me on, on a picnic. So on a picnic, I think that the, um, the blanket and the tote, perhaps the snack box and the can opener to include the ice pack matches with a picnic uh, idea but as far as the coffee itself that I don't know unless you're just going to take a picnic and you're going to have like croissants with a to-go coffee then it makes sense to me. don't know why I want to say that this box did not wow me um, but all of these items are just absolutely amazing and I guess because I am a big time coffee lover and I would have preferred that they would have included like let's say for example even though this little snack box is one of my favorite items I wish that they would have included an actual uh, cup and saucer for you to actually use uh, for this theme that would have been awesome but th those are just my thoughts other than that i really do like this box uh let me know if you received the pusheen box and if you have received the summer 2022 pusheen box what are your thoughts on this latest box can't wait for the next box hopefully it'll be halloween themed or christmas themed who knows so i want to thank you guys so much for watching this video please give this video a thumbs up if you have not subscribed to my channel please subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit that bell notification to notify you of when i upload a new video thank you so much for watching and have a great day